Well, hello, glorious people of the interwebs, and welcome back to Kingdom Hearts 3. Today, we're going to be showing you how to get a special item once you complete the Olympics main mission. This is going to be the first location you get in Kingdom Hearts 3, and man, am I glad to be playing this game. I've been waiting 14 years for Kingdom Hearts 3, ladies and gentlemen. 14 years. It's insane. But today, I'm going to be showing you where to get all the golden Hercules statues to get the champion's belt, which is going to be extremely useful very early in the game. So it's definitely something you're going to want to get. Now, to do this quest, you need to talk to this little boy here, and he will give us the quest we need to get this champion's belt. Hey, you like my figure collection? Pretty sweet, huh? I just need a set of golden hurts and then I'll be done. If you find any around town, can I have them? I need five. Please? Now, we just need to help this boy out, and I will show you exactly how to get all of these golden Hercules statues to complete his set and get yourself the champion's belt. Hope you guys all enjoyed the episode. If you want more tutorials like this in the future, let me know in the comments below. Uh, but I hope you guys all enjoy the episode. Now, we need to go to the hill to get the first statue. Now, for the first few of these, you're going to want to go back to the warp point. Now, you can these little save points count as warp points. And when you hit triangle on these, you can see here we can go to a different area. Now, we've got the Thebes of Agora. This is where you're going to accept the quest. We need to go to Thebes Overlook. And even in this little thumbnail, you can see one of the Golden Hercules statues right there. So we're going to move to this area here, and I'll show you all the locations within this particular area. Now, right off the bat, we're going to find one of the statues literally the second we warp into this particular area. Wow! Let's grab this bad Look boy. Look how high up we are. Oh, yeah. An action figure shaped like Hercules, small enough for non-heroes to throw. All right, so all you got to do is just pick that bad boy up. Now, the next one isn't going to be too far from here, but I think we need to actually go up to get this particular one. As you continue through this part of the map, you're going to come across this point where you jump down uh, these roofs. Now, we're going to do the same thing we did before, but we're going to stop at a certain point. So we got to jump down here. we got to land on this platform here. Oh, there we go. And wham, bam. Thank you, ma'am. There's another golden statue. Oh, yeah. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. So pretty much at this point, we've just gone through this particular area, and it's uh, been pretty straightforward. Now you can either run through the hills part, or you can go down into the garden and just run all the way through. And if you run all the way through, instead of warping to the garden, and go into this little set here, there's going to see a bronze statue ahead. Also, make sure to talk to this guy. He's going to give you this mithril, which is pretty nice. Uh, but if you walk into here, you're going to see this oh. golden statue. Oh, God! Nice little jump in action there. Golden statue right there. Now, the next one is going to be in this, like, fissure in the ground. Now... I'm not exactly sure where this is. Uh, so there's the warp point right there. Now, somewhere around here is going to be the fissure. And there it is right there. Okay. And I was like, I know it's around one of these current turns. And there we go. Wham, bam, thank you, ma'am. Got ourselves another golden Hercules statue. Yeah. All right. Let's go back to the warp point and find the rest of these. Now, if you warp back to where the boy is, we're going to go down this way right here. This is where the final Golden Hercules statue is going to be. Which is nice because if you follow this path, it'll basically circle you right back to where the boy is, and you'll be able to complete this in a very quick manner. Now we're going into this big building here, and in the back left corner, we're going to find another Hercules statue. There we go. Golden Herc figure, baby. All right. Now... This is also, a, you should take advantage of maybe leveling up and stuff like that, depending on the difficulty that you're playing on. Uh, spend some time traveling around Mount Olympus and stuff like that, leveling up. Might not be a bad idea. But now that we've got all of the figures, all we need to go is back here and turn these babies in. Now, if there's anything specific you would like to see in Kingdom Hearts 3, feel free to let me know in the comments below, and I may very well make a video on it. I got you, buddy. Oh, yeah. The Hero's Belt grants a moderate boost in defense and small boost in thunder, water, and arrow resistances. 
is definitely going to come in handy for especially in the early parts of the game where we don't have a lot of things here. Uh, so we're going to equip this on Sora. Now, I do have an accessory with... Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Whoops. I'm breaking all sorts of stuff. Now, is this, does this count as armor? There we go. The hero's belt. So we get defense three, frontline photographer, and then 20% resistance to thunder, water, and arrow. So no dark, fire, or blizzard, but still, it's a lot better than nothing. So that puts us up to 14 defense. And this is obviously really early in the game when we just got this, so... I hope you guys all enjoyed the tutorial. It's pretty quick, easy. I'm going to be showcasing where to get all the lucky charms. Here, lucky charms? The, the lucky things that are around here, as well as a video showcasing where to get all of the treasure humanly possible in Mount Olympus and each of the different worlds that you will encounter in Kingdom Hearts 3. Hope you guys all enjoyed it. Feel free to show your support and follow that like button if you did. And if you're new to the channel and want more content, make sure to subscribe. I'll see you all in the next one.